This hunting trip is long overdue. Yeah, I mean, it's just too bad that all like, the animals are so spread out, you know? I mean, wouldn't it be awesome if, if, if they were all grouped together, like, in a cafeteria, and you could just go in there with a trench coat and just waste them? Well, maybe I can stir up some quail or pheasant with my patented bird calls. Birds, quail, pheasant! Come on out! I'm a bird of the opposite sex who's interested in mating! <gasps> Did you hear that? We're gonna get laid! Billy, Billy, come on. Don't be stupid. Should have taken the shot, fat ass. Hey, Peter, you got your safety on, right? Yeah, of course. Okay, because your gun is pointing right at me. Wait, you want me to pull the trigger and prove it to you? No, I just want to make sure your safety's on. There, see, Quagmire? Safety's on. Now, this is a gun without a safety. Oh! Quite the difference, huh? Damn it, Peter, you son of a bitch! You shot me! Oh, my God, Peter, that might be the dumbest thing you've ever done. No, the dumbest thing I ever did was open that can of whoop-ass. Why did you buy this? It was on sale. Hey, Quagmire, what's with the cast? Did you hurt your arm after I shot you in the arm? The shooting was the injury, Peter. Look, I already said I was sorry like a hundred times. Oh, and before I forget, I want my Huey Lewis CD back. Well, I want a new drug. Okay, at least you've been using it. But I want it back, Peter. This is it. Ooh, ah. Damn it, Peter, just give it back. Oh, I can't give it back. I lost it in a poker game. What? I didn't think he could beat it, too. Where the hell do you get off betting my CD in a poker game? I don't think I like your tone. What? what? You're, you're saying I'm being the unreasonable one? Jeez, calm down, you guys. No, no, Joe, Joe, Joe. It's time somebody said this to him. Peter Griffin, you are an idiot. You can't even walk and chew gum at the same time. Peter, come on. Walk over here. I'm doing something. One thing at a time. Damn it, Peter, that's it. I am done. I'm done with you. I'm done with all your crap. I never want to speak to you again. This friendship is over. Well, fine. I don't need your friendship. I got other friends. I got my silent movie friends. Hey, Jerome, can you clear out my booth? Looks like somebody left their trash here. Jerome, can you tell that that to get the hell out of here before I kick him in the face? Peter, why don't you just sit in that booth over there? Ah, oh, man, that's where the after-work secretaries sit. What about Mr. Jemerson? Is he single? I, I, I don't know. What about Mr. Adelaide? Is he single? I don't know who that is. Well, who do you know who is single? Uh, I'm assuming you. Oh, oh hey, look, cake! Hey, Joe! Hey, Joe! I'm over here! Joe, Joe, come sit with me! Come on, you guys! Joe, I got a box of saltwater taffies, and you can have two. Joe, I got a deck of cards you can put in your wheels to look cool. Joe, I'll do the wavy stomach for you. <laughs> Looks like a real wave. Joe, I can scream your name real loud. Joe! 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 I can yell it louder. Joe! 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 What the hell is going on here? I'm in there trying to take a leak. What, you think I'm here to amuse you? You made me dribble on my Bruno Maglis turning to see who's calling my name. Joe Pesci thought we were talking to him because his name is Joe. Oh, you don't know who Joe Pesci is because you're 14. You see, in the 90s, this was a tough guy. 